Hey there, this is Steve from Stone Show. We're actually uh, filming, uh, doing a fitment for an i8, a BMW i8. And I believe the years run through uh, 2014 to 2020. It's uh, all the same gen, they haven't changed. So if you have an i8, this bracket will work. And it's gonna mount in the lower center there and uh, we'll go ahead and get started with fitment I'll turn it over to Mike all right thanks Steve yeah and this is going to be using two factory screws they're a six millimeter bolt with a ten millimeter hole, uh, head but we will be using new fasteners we will not be reusing these so we're going to have you have one here and you have one here and we're going to go ahead and take these out. Pretty straightforward installation. It's going to be two bolts in, or as I was, be two bolts out and then two bolts in. But again, it won't be these. We're going to be setting those off to the side and we're going to be using the two that we're going to provide you. Then, like I said, they're going to be a six millimeter by a 25 millimeter. And then we're going to be using two 3 16th spacers. And like I said, we're going right back into the hole we took them out of. And then we're going to be tightening them up. You can see you can slide it over a little bit like I did to get the spacer on the top. But again, this is a pretty straightforward installation. Let's get it. And again, these are going into a, a metal J-clip, and it is a six millimeter J-clip, so do not be afraid to, to tighten these up. Uh, you got you got plenty of material there to tighten them up with. So, as you can see, that's solid as a rock. And then once you're done with that, you're going to take your front plate, slide it in. You hit the pull pin, get it by the pull pin. Push it till it clicks into place. And there you go. Yeah, and make sure to uh, periodically lubricate the pull pin. And if you do go through a, an automated car wash, make sure you remove the front plate because the, uh, the rollers, they will do damage to your front, to the front and your license plate. So make sure that you remove it before you do that. And then let's, that's what uh, your plate's going to go on the front plate there, your license plate. And that's what it looks like. And you're all done. We're going to now show you how to mount the license plate to the uh, front bracket. You're going to take your plate, take the screw, put it through the plate, then line it up on the bracket, like so. Put the nylon lock nut on it. Now the nylon lock nut will have a nylon ring. And then no ring, so the ring goes to the outside. So when you put it on, make sure the ring goes to the outside. And then take your 10 millimeter socket or wrench, if you have just a wrench, Phillips screwdriver, and just tighten them up. Ring in there is going to keep it from rattling off. So there you go. That should, should look like when you're all done.